going to be documenting the, the process of making art, you know, to, to explore and expose the, the compromises inherent in the, art, the act of creation. I'm filming myself while I draw. Oh, cool. This school district has been run for long enough from the top down by sexist, racist, classist, officials, and administrators. Camelot has given a lot to me. It's a great school district, and I want to make sure that every student can get as much out of this school as I have. My dad sent it to me. He usually sends like designer bags and Hamilton tickets, but he actually visited me for once, and he just thought it'd be better bribing me with electronics. I need your laptop. No, I need the laptop for my West Point application. Don't you want to take, like, calculus or something? Did Hannah tell you to say that? I thought maybe we could have two different types of parties. One for the adults, and then one for, say, anyone 25 and under. Because those two groups definitely have completely different ideas on what fun is. Alright. And I think like Vicky should be... play in the boring one. Aren't you the one who beat up Lambert Rake? You gave him a concussion. How are we supposed to work with someone like that? You, you can support a women hating, anti immigrant, anti gay, evil fascist party if you want to, but you're not gonna do it here, so get out of my house! And I would have just said no, but I was right in the middle of trying to work on my figure drawing project for class, and I was realizing how terrible of a model Izzy is. So I said I would join the committee if Gavin sat for me. Nelly! Uh, just give her a moment. Well, when Gareth's frog died, you know, my parents, they wanted to flush it down the toilet, but he started crying. Gavin offered to let Mordred stay with him for a while. Well, he's let me stay with him often enough, but... But after the first night, uh, Gavin's parents were kind of over the whole permanent sleepover arrangement. Yeah, to say the least. My parents are going to Hawaii, but they said I didn't have to come, so... If you take a coin from the pond, and every time you flip it, it lands on heads, you will have luck. Meaning, whatever your next endeavor is cannot go wrong. But here's the catch. You only get three tails. So on the third tails, if you flip it one more time and don't return it, then all of the luck that you've gotten from this coin will sour and it will return back to you like three times as bad. You guys aren't serious. Why not? Well, I know Vicky believes in the bad luck omens and stuff, but you guys don't really believe in lucky coins.